Hey guys, what's going on? It is Castle Perfect here, bringing you a live commentated um, showdown video. And uh, I am using a kind of a weird team, and I know about it. Uh, I am just trying out something new, and uh, I decided that it would be a good thing for you guys to take a look at this because I think this team is quite fun. So, anyways, my opponent is going to start off with a Tornadus Ethereum form. Uh, very interesting. I'm going to go for the Mega Evolution right off the bat, and. Um, I am going to set up the Stealth Rocks because I think he's going to switch, or apparently he's not. So he's going to U-turn out, which is good. I think he's going to bring out the Slowbro now, or maybe the Hippodon. Uh, he has like, every single Pokemon on his team is like, a counter to this thing. So, uh, in, com in comes Blastoise, which is, it's okay in a way. Um, it's most likely going to be his Mega Evolution. Because I don't see any other possible Mega on his team, so I guess that I should uh, switch out into Fatlax here and see what he goes for. Maybe a Rapid Spin, I think. Yeah, he's gonna go for the Rapid Spin. I should have gone for the Stone Edge, though. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go for the Crunch and uh, see how much damage I can get off this guy. Hopefully, I'll get that Defense Drop, which I'm fishing for, or maybe the Body Slam will do more. Uh, it just depends. Alright, so he's gonna switch out into the Tank Growth. Body Slam, gets the Power Hacks, absolutely awesome, and uh, I'm gonna go for the Fire Punch now. Let's go! Critical hit! <laughs> That's a lucky, lucky shot, really. Um, he's gonna go for the knockoff though, and I'm not gonna go for another Fire Punch because I think he's gonna predict me, so I'm just gonna go for the Body Slam. <clears throat> Alright, so he switches out and goes out into High Powder. I go for the Body Slam, and this time I unfortunately don't get the Power Hacks, but that's okay. I'm gonna go for another body slam though. I was gonna set up the stealth rocks, which is fine. I get another crit. I don't know what's going on here, but um, <laughs> I'm absolutely lucky right now. So I'm up all night to get some. Okay, he's gonna kill me. All right, down goes Snorlax, and uh, I know it could have been avoided, but um, if I'll be honest with you guys, I did not feel like it. I thought that Fatlax just wasn't the guy for me. So I'm gonna bring out Cactur and I'm possibly going to scare him out. And uh, I'm just gonna go for the Sword Dance on the Switch. Um, I don't know what he's gonna switch out into. I think he's gonna switch out into his Celebi, which would make sense, but um, you know, it's fine. I don't care. Alright, in comes Celebi and I'm gonna go for the Sword Dance and I don't know what this Celebi can do at this point. I think he's gonna attack me, so I'm just gonna go for the Sucker Punch. Uh, deal some super effective damage and see if I can take him out after a plus two attack. Or maybe he might just double switch. Oh no, I failed. Okay, so what is he gonna do? Oh, okay, okay, he's gonna go for a heal bill, which is fine. Uh, he might just switch out right now, but I'm just gonna continue to go for the sucker punch in case he decided to over predict and stay in and go for an attacking move. So let's go ahead and find out what he goes for. So he's gonna switch, he's not gonna risk it, which is fine. Like I said, it's fine. I, I have no idea how bulky that thing is, but I'm just gonna go for another Sucker Punch. It's gonna take him out! Absolutely monstrosity! That's what you are, Cacturn. And it was my first shiny ever, though, which I'm very glad about. I'm gonna go for a Drain Punch. Yeah, that's what, what I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna recover a little bit of HP, and the Life Warp Recoil is gonna, you know, activate right there, and Cacturn is actually doing some work, and he's gonna leave! Wow, really? Why? Why do you leave? That's not fun. He even had a superior team. A lot of walls though, holy shit. Alright, let's try another one. Because this one was so short. Now, his team looks a little bit more original in a way. So once again, I'm gonna start off with Aerodactyl because I think that I'll have the upper hand anyway. Alright, so Mega Evolution right off the bat, that's exactly what I like to do. and. Um, I am going to... I don't know, I think he's gonna attack me though. Um, I'm just gonna set up the Stealth Rocks because it's important. I don't see any Rapid Spinner on his team though. He's gonna go for the Ice Gold Spear. Which is gonna hit three times, or four times, and kills me. Well, that sucks, man. Um, Alright, well, that's fine. I guess that I'll just go ahead and bring out Castador at this point. And I am not going to go for the Dynamic Punch, seeing as how he's got a Drifling on his team. And a Gardevoir. So I think that Earthquake... No, Earthquake will not affect the Drifflin. I'm gonna go for the Stone Edge, though. Oh my god, he stays in. Very good play on his part. Absolute beast. 
and uh, Sheasel, my Nizel. That Pokemon does a lot of damage. Uh, this time I'm gonna go for the uh, Dynamic Punch. I just hope it doesn't help predict me here uh, or predict uh, my Dynamic Punch because that would totally suck. All right, so it stays in and takes that Dynamic Punch, and that Pillow Swine just oh my god, he just broke havoc in my team. He just pretty much di did so much damage. I don't like that. So. Cassador, you need to pull through. I don't even know why you're female, but okay. You're supposed to be a male, though. Uh, in comes this thing. Hmm. It can be a special attacker or one of those annoying um, thing shift. I know, status problem shift uh, attack. I don't remember what the attack is called, but uh, it basically just switched around the status problems to the opposite. Uh, to the opposition, so I think that I'm I'm better off switching out into Fadlax because I don't think he has anything to hit me with. That's perfect. All right. Um, what next? I can go for the Crunch, but I think that he'll be bringing out that sock, and um, I don't want to face that thing just yet. All right, so it's burned, by the way. So it's got Flare Boost. Hmm, interesting. I have one of these things in my box in my Nintendo 3DS, but I've never tried it out, really. I don't even know why I bred it. I'm never using it. Okay, so he's gonna go for the Switch. So I'm gonna predict the Switch into Sock, and I'm just gonna go for Body Slam. Oh my god, Hidden Power is super effective, so it is apparently uh, fighting. And uh, that sucks. I'm gonna go for the Rest now. I need to recover all my HP back to full. Uh, wake up, and then go for the Crunch and take him out. Because I need to have fat legs at a decent amount of HP because that Guard of War is really going to do some damage to my team if I don't take care of it. Alright, income Sock and... Um, mm, okay, Sock, what are you going to do? I'm going to switch out into what am I? Because seriously, what is that? Uh, it's going to go for the close combat, does about 50%, just below 50%, 48.8, which is okay. Um, hmm. What to go for? Uh, he might uh, be packing the ice punch and kill me immediately, but I, that, that, I'll be fine with that because I can then go out into explode and uh, basically explode. <laughs> um, earthquake. There is nothing else on his team that will appreciate an earthquake. But then again, glare paralyzing slow already slow Pokemon is always not really. Okay, I'm just gonna go for the Earthquake here, see what happens, I have no idea. Um, does a little bit of damage, which is good, and um, I think that I'm gonna be switching out right now, because he's gonna go for an Ice Beam. And uh, I'm gonna switch out into Fadlax, and I'm gonna take that Avalanche like a monster. It's a physical Lapras, well, that's something else, you don't see that often, but uh, I'm gonna go for the Body Slam here, and uh, try to paralyze something. He's gonna go for the Rest, which is good. I don't care, um, and it might be one of those uh, sleep talkers, I, I have no idea, but I'm just gonna go for another body slam, so I go for the sleep talk, gets a rest, but it failed, I'm gonna hit him with another body slam, um, he is very unlucky, and uh, once again he just leaves the battle, what is going on ladies and gents, everybody's leaving the battle, I don't like this, one more time then, one more time, three battles for this video, guys remember to drop a like if you enjoy this. Uh, there is no music, which is unfortunate because I like to be listening to music when I'm at, whenever I'm battling. But um, I just put some background music down on this video. So look for the battle one more time. This team is undefeated so far, so things are going pretty good, I'd say. Uh, searching for a battle, team number one. Uh, it's the first team that I've created. Oh my God, this looks more menacing than I thought it would look like uh, on my next battle. So. Arcanine Celebi, or Arcanine possibly Choice Bandit or Choice Scarf, I'd say Choice Bandit uh, because I run one myself. Celebi the support set, usually lead seed, heal bell, you name it. Blasto is the Mega Evolution, no wait, Gardevoir is going to be the Mega Evolution. This is going to be the Rapid Spinner, uh, Metagross for the Hard Hitter and uh, I Dragon possibly the Choice Scarf. So, um, what would be a good uh, lead? I think that a good lead would be... Hmm. I'd say Machamp, but Machamp is too slow. I'm just gonna go for Aerodactyl one more time and see what happens. So it's gonna lead up with Now You See Me. Okay, well that's cool. I do in fact see you, and I am going to kill you. I'm gonna go for the Crunch. 
Get that strong claw going on. Does more than 50% damage. He's gonna activate. Oh my, are you serious? Weakness policy, and he's gonna go for the Calm Mind. He's not gonna be able to actually do anything to me because I'm faster. Oh well, that's perfect. You just wasted your Celebi though. Uh, but he might switch. Keep that in mind. He might. I'm gonna go for the Ice Fang now. All right, that's super effective. Takes him down anyway. I was like, he might switch out into uh, his Hydreigon and take that, but um, he doesn't. So that's great. So Celebi is down very early, six to five, and uh, in comes this thing. Okay. Hmm. Specially orientated. I'm gonna switch out into Fadlax here and uh, see what he goes for. He goes for Flash Cannon. That's new. I don't see Hydreigons uh, using Flash Cannon that often. So I'm going to go for a Body Slam and try to paralyze something. He goes for the Focus Blast. Holy shit, and he hits. I'm very lucky. I don't get the uh, Para Hacks, unfortunately, but um, I guess that's how the cookie crumbles, I guess. I'm just gonna go for another Body Slam. He Okay, so he misses the Focus Blast this time, which is perfect. And down goes Hydreigon, and I think this guy is gonna... Yeah, I, I knew it. Why are these people just... Are you kidding me? Why is everybody leaving? This team is not even that powerful. I would... Uh, or maybe it's powerful. I don't know. <laughs> um, well, anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Remember to leave a, a like on this video if you enjoyed it, because I might do this more if you guys like this. It's uh, real quick. I got better internet right now, so I can upload a lot faster. More entertainment, more diversity, you name it. Pokemon that you would like me to use on Pokemon Showdown, you name it. I'll just use them, and uh, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.